Ladies and gentlemen, the Nerf Big Shock. This is, in my opinion, the best Nerf pistol ever, and here's why. It fires mega darts, you just put one in the front, pull down the handle, and you're good to go. But with a simple mod I've done, and there's a link in the description to this mod, very simple, and I mean it when I say that, you can convert the Big Shock from shooting mega darts to elite darts, and it shoots these even harder. My favorite ammunition, rival high impact rounds. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm pleased to say that today we are gonna convert the Big Shock to shoot the final form of Nerf ammunition, the rival round. Here's what you need. First of all, PEX pipe. I use this stuff all the time and there's pictures here. So this is the PEX pipe you're gonna need. And you're also gonna need coupling. This coupling, coupling is the word of the day. Coupling, coupling, coupling. This is the one you need, right there. That'll do the trick. For this project, you're also gonna need electrical tape and scissors, pipe cutters if you have them. I'm gonna use scissors just because I'm guessing most people ask what they have. Let's go ahead and get started. So basically, how's this mod gonna work? Well, this PEX pipe is the perfect size to house a Nerf dart. As you can see there, Nerf dart. It also happens to fit quite well onto this coupling. As you can see, coupling slides over it just like so. Now the Big Shock takes mega darts and there's actually an air restrictor in there. What an air restrictor does is, it's actually kind of a safety. There's three little prongs on springs and unless those prongs are pushed down, air won't flow out. So when you pull down the bottom handle and you pull the trigger, you'll notice how slowly the handle goes back. That's because the safety isn't switched. Once you put a mega dart in, the foam at the bottom of the dart pushes the springs down and then it'll just shoot really fast and loud. But we don't have that. So, what we're gonna do is cut off a length of pipe. Okay, so I changed my mind. Pipe cutters would work better, and if you don't have those, use an X-Acto blade or an X-Acto knife. Scissors don't work. So, using an X-Acto or a pipe cutter, just cut off a length of it. Now what you wanna do is put it down the barrel of your big shock. Something you may notice is that when you put the PEX pipe into the coupler, it's only gonna go as far as to where it expands. So we know that when we put the PEX pipe down the barrel and then put the coupler up next to it, we can make the marks for where to cut. I purposely cut this just a hair larger than it needs to be so that we can trim down rather than having it too short. But the next step is to take your electrical tape and buffer up one of the ends of the PEX pipe. If you've seen the other video on how to make a Big Shock shoot regular Nerf darts, you'll notice that so far, fairly similar. Also, there's a common myth that uh, rival rounds and mega ammunition are the same width, which isn't true, which is why we need the coupler. So I've buffed up the end of one side with electrical tape and I did a little too much. So what you can do is you can do too much and then slowly remove it till you get the right amount. And it's important that you get just the right amount. It's also important that you get this electrical tape as close to the end of the pipe as you can, because it's gonna be the buffer that pushes down the, uh, the little spring pegs. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know you've done it when you pull this down and it just shoots really hard back. So that's all it took. Now it's time to put the coupler on. So it should just slip over the top if you bought the right kind. And that's it. Put in a rival round. Boom, bang. And that's it, guys. If you like uh, the Rivals ammunition, check this out. You just put it in the end like that, and it shoots hard. I'm totally happy with the way this is performing. These rounds are also really, really easy to load because you can literally just pop them in the front like that, and there you go. What's also really cool is the Mega Big Shock when you leave the shell on, this is what it looks like without a shell, but if you leave it on, when this gun comes to you, it's got a slot on top to hold extra mega darts, but you can actually use it to hold your rival's ammo. Check that out. And this is why the rival's ammo is the best. When you get a big shock, you get one dart in the chamber and one stored up top. When you use the elite dart mod that I have, you can now shoot elite darts. They shoot straighter and harder with the mod than the stock gun does but now you can't store anything up top and it's a one shot, one kill. Now, this is a five shot pistol. For its size, being five shots is amazing. So that's the mod, I hope you guys enjoy it. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you tried it and it worked for you. I personally love this mod. It works amazingly well. And like I said, Rivals Ammo is my favorite ammunition just because of its simplicity. 
and it's fairly accurate. All right, guys, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this mod. It's been a long time, and uh, last time I did a mod for this kind of stuff with the Big Shock, you guys really seem to love it. I love these mods because they're super simple. You don't need to take the gun apart at all, and they are actually very effective, and they, they do quite a bit, you know? You're changing the ammo, your gun shoots very, very simply, and I love that. So if you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that big thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe because I have new videos every single Saturday. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. You know what to do. And as always, this was Nerf Boy Productions, signing off.